one of Australia's most mystifying murder cases. Australia's most notorious mafia murder almost didn't happen because one of the crooks was worried about the fallout from police. Donald Mackay's disappearance was a watershed moment for police and the mafia in Australia. My read of this situation was that the murder of Donald Mackay was driven by personal animosity, not a business decision. The murder of this aspiring politician and anti-drugs campaigner in 1977 stunned the nation. A father of four killed in cold blood outside the pub in Griffith, New South Wales. The Donald Mackay murder is probably one of the most notorious murders we've had in Australia's history. It is a political murder and it is partly unresolved to this day. It led to an unprecedented crackdown and two royal commissions to find the killer. But there was allegedly a debate within the Mafia about whether to go ahead with the murder. He said to me, I was the only one that disagreed with the strategy to assassinate Donald Mackay. Not because I was a saint or not because I had any ethical concerns, but because I thought that if we did that, we would bring police attention to Griffith. He was a strong anti-drugs campaigner, as believed. That is what led to his murder. And there was such massive heat on them that they literally had a board meeting of the bosses and said, never again will we kill someone as high profile as Donald Mackay. The Mafia's grass castles, mega mansions built with drug money, sparked intense police interest. Some Mafia bosses, like the late Tony Sergi, claimed they were just businessmen and victims of racism. I've been worked here in this, this uh, farm. I've been here now for 24 years and a half, nearly 25 years on the same place. And I've never done nothing wrong by nobody. For the Mackay family, especially wife Barbara, Donald's murder was a wound that never healed. I had, uh, I guess, the pleasure and misfortune at the same time to talk to Donald Mackay's wife and she was really very emotional when we chatted and she, all she wanted was an answer to the, the death of her husband. 